The blood of hate. How does it affect you? Do you feel it now? The blood of hate? Yes. Nothing more than a sneeze, really. A sneeze held for so long, you could blow a fortress down if you released it. Can we speak about the Morrigan? The Red Queen? What of her? Do you know who she is? I don't want to discuss this in front of my sweet Elizabeth. Why? For a time, she too could hear the Red Song. The steps she danced to its melody brought pain upon the world. You met her, did you not? Just once. But she never ceased to sing to me. I love her song. It is a song of blood and war. I only wish she would sometimes let me rest. I would like to ask you about vampires. Vampires? What about them? Considering your experience, please, tell me what you know. They are terrible creatures. I have seen and fought many in my time. Foul temptresses with sharp claws and shrieking beaks. Where did you encounter such creatures? The last time I saw one was in a Celtic temple near Salisbury. A terrible and godforsaken place full of ghosts and pestilence. I have never seen such a creature. What are you talking about? Of course you've never seen a creature like them. Vampires are deadly, swift and implacable. Do you remember Murden, your maker? Only God is my maker. For he created everything on this earth. He blessed me with eternal life through his archangel, Michael. But Murden, Michael, is a vampire. He made you a blood-sucking creature of the night. Blood, yes. I used to drink it from the throats of the unworthy. Then I was punished for my deceit. During my penance, I rely entirely upon my sweet Elizabeth. Tell me about Elizabeth. How was she infected? I do not wish to discuss it. Please, Sir William. I need to know what the blood of hate is. How is it transmitted? After defeating a disaster in St. Paul's Cathedral, I returned to my retreat, infected. This is where my sweet Elizabeth found me, for she heard my pain from across the sea. What happened then? The blood of hate had twisted me into a rage-filled man. I attacked my progeny and infected her too. Forgive me, Elizabeth. I failed you. You bit her again? Is that how she was infected with the disaster's blood? I think I understand now. Elizabeth fled, and I fell to my knees, begging for forgiveness. I swore I would find a way to make things right. Where is this retreat you mentioned? In London, under Temple Church, beneath my empty tomb. I always love to sleep there while listening to the bell above. How did you meet Elizabeth? Times were tough. I had awakened to protect the land from a new plague. I heard her sing for her dead family. Singing for her death to come. I chose to save her. What did you do? I raised her as my progeny. After she left to see the world, I rebuilt her deceased parents' inn. Owned it as William Thorne for a time. Those were good years. When was that? It was so long ago. 
A few years after Elizabeth of England and Catherine of France established their alliance against Spain, 